Hi guys, this is Anna from Anna and Ivy and January Bloom and today I will show you how to use our golden animated geometric frames inside of DaVinci Resolve because this is an alternative program for those of you who don't have access to the Adobe Cloud and it's completely for free, you can download it for Windows and Mac. We will start at the capping section. I already prepared my project, which is the size for Instagram stories. You can uh, change the size at the beginning or in the middle of your project. Um, this is the size I use for Instagram stories. And I have already dragged my animated um, frame inside and an image I got from Unsplash. So the first thing is to drag your image or video clip to the timeline, the base, and adjust the size. You can adjust the size over here. If you don't see this section, simply click on this small icon and I will scale it up. And we will adjust the colors later. The next step is to drag my animated frame on top of my image. Here we go. And the first thing you will recognize is that the frame is longer than the image itself. This is because our frame has 50 seconds, which is perfect for Instagram stories. And simply drag your image to the right. Here we go. So, when we go through our timeline, you will see how our frame is moving and I will adjust the frame position as well as the scale again with the small icon and put it a bit to the right. You can also rotate it but if you like to and scale it a bit. Here we go. So the next thing we will do, we will add some text. Go to Titles and drag it to your timeline. Here we go. Also adjust the length. So we have this 50 seconds. To adjust the text, simply click again on Tools and over here on the text icon and open the inspector. So I will create a save the date digital invitation. Write my text in here. Choose a font and adjust your text. So I will repeat these steps with the following two words. So in the next step, I will adjust the color of my background. I will click on my main layer in the color section and I want to make it a bit lighter. And maybe also drag the contrast a bit down. So now I want to adjust the color of my golden frame a bit. I select the frame in the second section here, make it a bit bigger and then simply go to blues and drag them a bit up to get this yellow out. So here we go, now that I adjusted the color of our frame as well as the background, I'm ready to go. Of course you can animate the font inside here, whatever you like. 
but this is only a basic overview how the program works. There are plenty of tutorials on YouTube if you want to know more about DaVinci Resolve, but I just wanted to show you a quick um, option to use a free program to be able to use our um, animation sets. So yeah, that's it. Now we will export our video clip. We go to the deliver section and then choose H.264 as a setting. Make sure your format is set to F4, not to QuickTime because I think QuickTime is the standard here. And then add it to your render section and then simply start the rendering. So now that our video clip is ready, we can now send it to our phone and post it on social media as an Instagram story or maybe send it to your friends as a digital invitation for your wedding or whatever you celebrate. And yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this small tutorial and wish you a lot of fun with the collection. Bye!